Hey y'all, it's your girl Millie Chan. Let's get into a minute. Let's go. Y'all join us Wednesday. This coming up Wednesday, I will be on Confessions of a Reality Queen channel. You can find us on Twitch, Instagram, or YouTube. And I will be her first guest on her first podcast, 21 Questions with Confessions. I'm so excited. I'll remind you about it, but I'm really excited about this. Condolences goes out to Nicole Murphy. Her boyfriend, uh, Warren Braithwaite, has since passed away with cancer. Um, I don't know how long they were together, but hold on. I think this was awesome that they were close with her ex-husband and things like that. But there's something that's real crazy. Hold on. Why is Nicole over here liking Simon's photo? Ma'am, you are in mourning. You shouldn't even be on the internet. Simon just posted this photo like yesterday when we found out about her boyfriend. What is going on? And then this is in Simon's story. For those who have made wellness pit stops in my DM, thank you. Who is dropping in Simon's DMs? Like the man may be deported. Is there no shame? <laughs> Let's keep going. Child, meanwhile, Portia said it's angels all around us at 11-11. Go on, Portia. Williams. PJ's so cute. Let's keep going. So for my trader people, they are getting ready to do the reunion for traders. All of the people are together. Look at all the Bravo ladies with Andy, because Andy will be hosting it. I'm so excited. Fedra did great, but I'm really disappointed. I feel like she gave up, but I can't wait to hear this reunion. I can't wait. Child for part 51, Risa Tisa is going to be on Good Morning America Monday. I'm so excited about this. I got to call my mom and let her know. I got to call my mom. Child, I ran across this over on TikTok. Off of Risa, onto Legion. And just listen to the lies that he tells. I'm just going to play a little part. Just, just hold on. California, that was true? Yeah, I was there for school. Okay, because she said she never, she said she did some background research and, you know, that never popped up, that you lived school don't, That school, they don't give, they don't give you any student information. The reason they don't, um, I, I think it's 2003, somebody went looking for somebody at the college and they weren't there, but they gave information to, for the person and the person ended up getting killed. So their student policy is very strict. I will say this again. I'm glad Legion did not have a serial spirit on him because I'm just happy that Risa is here today because that man is crazy. Let's keep going. I don't know how true this is. Hold on. Best news I've heard all day from the dentist. Okay, I hate to announce I will no longer review Married to Medicine on YouTube. They told on me and my man said I had to get off. However, y'all can go over there. She got a Patreon account. $5 or $10. Y'all can go listen to it. She just would not be on YouTube. Thank you, Jesus, for small favors. Let's keep going. So lastly, if you want to hear this full interview from Mark Curry, he is a former bad boy artist. You can go to College Kid on X, right? But what he's talking about is allegedly Diddy had paid Shine a million dollars for doing a 10-year bid for him when they had that situation in 1999 in the nightclub where he did this action at a man throwing money in Puffy's face. And you remember that's when Puffy and J-Lo were together and shortly after this, J-Lo quit Puffy? Honestly, I know it's alleged because I was not there. But with everything that we are hearing about Puff, this seems right on tax for him to have somebody to do something to someone if they threw something at him. This just doesn't, this seems like the mildest thing that he could do. What do you all think about this? Let's talk about it. It's your girl, Millie Chun. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.